Hey guys, how are you today? Okay, today I bring you another video and I, we're doing a second book review this week. I actually was going to try to do three, but I don't th think I'm going to get the third one read before the end of the week. But I did get this one read and while, <laughs> while I didn't want to like it, obviously I did. If you look at all the post-it sticky notes in that I put in here, um, this is called The Four Agreements. Um, a Toltec Wisdom Book by Don Miguel Ruiz, and I loved this book. There is some great practical advice about life and living. I am going to read you one or two quotes. 95% um, of the beliefs we have stored in our minds are nothing but lives, lies, and we suffer because we believe those lies. The whole dream is based on a false law. I find that interesting, and probably if you take it in context, it might be more interesting. Um, we are already in hell, including the people who tell us that no human can condemn another to hell because we are already there. Others can put us into a deeper hell, true, but only if we allow this to happen. I love this book, and there's lots of other little jewels of wisdom in here. Um... There's one I think I'm going to actually put in my journal, and it's one on death. Um, 2016, we had, saw a lot of famous people pass. Um, some had long, very well-lived lives. Um, also, you know, most of us have had um, one or two people we know in real life pass, and my husband and I are no exception to that rule. Um, death is not the biggest fear we have. Our biggest fear is taking the risk to be alive, the risk to be alive and express what we really are. That's pretty profound to me, and so I'm going to um, I'm going to do some writing in my book on this in my journal, and then I have to take all the sticky notes out because this book actually doesn't belong to me, which is why I put sticky notes and didn't get in there with a highlighter pen, <laughs> which I was tempted to do. All right, I did take a picture of the cover of the book, and I printed it here with my little LG Pocket Photo printer, which is now charging because it's almost dead. Um, and this printer I got on eBay, um, I'm not eBay, sorry, on Amazon, and um, I'll put the exact name of it into the January materials list, so go to the file section in the Facebook group to look for that. Uh, the link to the group will be in the description below the video if you're not already a member. And um, the printer is operated with an app on your smartphone, and it prints these little small prints, and this particular paper happens to be sticky back which I love, and I take this with me on vacations and traveling when I go because it is so small. It fits great in my art bag or my backpack um, if my art bag is too full, which it sometimes is. And I just have to remember to bring the charging cable in case it runs out of juice and usually extra paper. So let's go in here, and this is what I have so far for January. I put my word of the year in here. Jerry Bellini had us all doing words of the year, so I put my word in. And we, on the last art video, created some um, sparkle and bling with some candy wrapper papers and some embossing folders. So that was fun. So let's go back here and let's put our book in. Let's see. Okay, and I'm going to take my copy of my cover Let's unstick the paper, which is sometimes tricky. <laughs> it doesn't always want to come off. I'm going to stick it here. And we're going to take one of our quotes. I might do the death one, but there's a lot of other quotes in here.
This is another good one. We create this image, but this image is not real. We are never going to be perfect from this point of view. How much? How many of us have that problem with perfection? Probably a lot. I'm going to do this one because this is um, this one's resonating with me this morning. So. Okay, our image of perfection is the reason we reject ourselves. It is why we don't accept ourselves the way we are and why we don't accept others the way they are. I find that pretty profound. So, The Four Agreements, it is definitely a book I recommend. Um, it, was a, it was a fairly easy read. I found it really interesting, and uh, I think you might too. So look it up in your library or um, buy a copy of it um, on Amazon. I will uh, add it to my book review list, and I will put the link to this video there too. And uh, yeah, that's it for right now. I hope you have a great day. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you can, support my YouTube channel by shopping in my Etsy shop. Uh, the link is in the description below. Or going to the YouTube channel's main page and and hit that fan funding button. Um, don't forget the most important thing though. Go out and have a great day and do something nice for yourself because you know you deserve it. I know you do too and that's it. All right, I'll talk to you later. Bye guys.